Hey guys, Greg here, Underground Graphics. Gonna do a quick vid for you today. Uh, we had a request for the rear window of your Bronco. Um, we did have a four door here that we did some graphics on here uh, this week and we're able to make a quick template. And as you can see, we've got this kind of just barely laid in place. We're gonna have that cut out here for that wiper. So you really don't have to take that off. You can lift that up, but we can, it's a lot easier to get the tire off, get that off, really have easy access to that. Um, but again, if this is a 37, so if you want it, if you've got a stock wheel and, and you've got the room to do that, you just need to get someone to, you know, to kind of hold up that piece. This is going to be 3M Control Tack uh, vinyl, which is um, air release. So it is an easy install to dry install. Um, don't let the size of that freak you out. Um, because again, we've, we've got, we've got the cutouts. Um, you're going to have a little bit of room to, to play and, and, you know, you've got about a quarter inch of, of uh, shift on that. Um, we'll use that alcohol solution i believe we're doing 10 percent alcohol 90 percent water um, on that again it's just to get the fingerprints the contaminants whatever off that glass um, some masking tape pair of scissors and a hard squeegee i don't believe we're going to have a squeegee in that kit with you for this but again this is that one that'll come with that mask a credit card will work, will work just fine for, for something of this nature um, anyway again We've already taken this off. Um, obviously you know how to take a spare tire off. If you need to get that uh, third brake light down, I believe that was a Torx 30 that I was using for these bolts here. And then a half inch for the nut for that wiper. You'll just pop the cap off of the back of that wiper, half inch socket on that, give it a turn. It'll take a little bit to just kind of pop that off, but it does come off fairly easy. Um, okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and tape this up. Um, I did not wipe this down. But again, this is going to come right off after we put this on. But just real quick. I hope you guys have been enjoying the channel. Uh, we have uploaded some new content this week, or should be coming in here very shortly. Uh, we've got three new uh, kits. One is called the Eddy, which we did on another Eruption Green, uh, which is the Eddy Bauer style kit. Um, that includes another piece called the Spear, which follows that um, upper crease. Um, Gianna, if you want to grab a quick, quick shot of that Spear kit, this is that Spear that runs all the way down. That's available for two door, four doors, single color, two color, uh, also digital print um, and then we've got another kit that we've worked weeks on that is for the diehards which is going to be that retro fade which I'm sure you've seen uh, that blue fade or that orange fade looks like a sunburn over the whole vehicle um, lots of fun doing that one and uh, again we've got some photos and stuff of that up already on Bronco 6G and those should be up on the site as well so now that we got that clean, again, we want that masking tape. And again, we've got those holes pretty much pre-cut for you, so you don't have to cut anything other than just the backing off. Um, we've got a little bit just inside the glass on the edges, and again, if you want to just I even cut this one a little bit thin on that, but once that it gets around there, you can see. And then just center. Make sure you're good horizontal. That is good. That is really all we need. Just make sure all those edges are even. And scissors. We're going to do that, what we call the hinge method. And again, this is 3M Control Tack, so it is air release, but it is still a calendared film. Um, so, for what we're doing on these back windows, just fine. Uh, you'll have many years even in the sun with this. We've also updated our distressed look on our. US flags um, to be less more of that gunshot look and more of a, of a, of a tear. Um, this would be the version two. We will probably phase out that version one. This looks a little bit better. 
but for now they're all be up there and for this back window as well we'll have some other options uh the texas flag we'll probably do some retro sunsets and just some you know whatever design you want to do now that we have this template for this back window we're good if you see there we got we started to get a little wrinkle there again since these are stripes we can just work that piece up not worry about what's happening in there and we got our right side down you are going to want to be careful here because as we get we have this cut out here for that piece that's going to want to flop a little bit so we're going to kind of really go from the top around and come back down on that um, but again even if you mess something up where it comes down work your way around it we can lift, pick up that piece after the fact go back lay it back down this is glass so it really is a perfect surface to lift it back up um, and you can lay that back down but again i'm going to just hold back half of that hold this fairly tight but keep you know you can still have that off the glass you just barely got that hanging over I think I lost a piece of tear on that guys that is really it um, with this paper mask it's not super tacky but if you want to make this a little bit easier to remove a little bit of water um, this is alcohol but still just to get this a little bit wet I'll kind of soften that paper um, all right so yeah and then just gonna get that wet again you don't have to do this it just makes it a little a little bit easier as it softens that adhesive Again, without doing this dry like that makes it so much easier and again air release wrinkle free there's no bubbles no wrinkles it's just right the first time ready to go you don't have to wait once this is on you will see that side didn't go down good but i can feel that right back up push that right back down Yeah, let's take off and drive or after we put our spare tire and brake light back in um so yeah that's it you don't need to watch me put that stuff back on there just opposite of what we did to take that off um but again if you guys have any questions want to see something custom on here let us know we're going to add this to our rear window decals for the bronco um i'm not certain this is, will fit a two-door i'd imagine ford did the same glass on that back but if somebody wants to give us a shout let us know We'll find out soon enough and get that added as well. Um, anyway, thanks a lot. Um, be sure and like and subscribe. And remember, when we hit 1,000 subscribers, we'll be giving away a $250 gift certificate. So be sure and share, tell your friends, and uh, see you shortly. Thank you.